Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin, you got anything in there? Anything funky that I should be aware of? Anything that's maybe not allowed over the border? All right, fair enough, I trust you. Ah, okay, well, now that I know I can trust you, we have to stop all the other people who cannot be trusted and are bringing vile contraband into our country. I'm not even sure what we'll be looking for. Weapons, I assume. Counterfeit potatoes. That's the worst thing about being Irish. There's so many counterfeit potatoes. I hate thinking I'm getting a name brand potato and then I open it up and it's a counterfeit. Anyway, I won't go into a rant, but we're about to start a new game. Join me in Contraband Police. The dream job. <laughs> Border crossing, Akrastan, 1981. I don't know how I slept through this music, to be honest with you, dude. All right, we're here. Oh my God, were you driving with no hands that entire time? God, Rush is so ahead of us when it comes to self-driving vehicles. I wasn't listening to the dialogue at all, but I'm sure I'll be fine. Thanks for the ride. Oh Jesus, I didn't know you were in there. Why are you just hiding in here? Oh no, the previous border officer was arrested. And in other news, citizens satisfied with the government. As many as 9 out of 10 citizens support the actions of the ruling party. Unemployment is falling, salaries are rising, and the curfew is now only at 11 p.m. Is this where I get my job? Oh, oh my god, I have the flashlight now. Okay, that makes it official. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I didn't know this was occupied. I guess I'll just wait for the bathroom. This is the bathroom, right? Because I didn't see anywhere else. Just leaving all the doors open. Yeah, there is no other bathroom. That must be it. We got some build up here. Is anyone else doing this job or is it just me? Hello, are you going to let them in? That is a lot of information I got to get on people. Great, let's get started. Just to be clear, I didn't read that. <laughs> I'm sure it'll be fine though. Go and make your way right over here. If you can pull up up there, that'd be great. Sayada. Oh my God, he's getting shouty now. All right, fine, we'll see. <laughs> I just got to carjack him and then he's like, no. <laughs> I've seen your videos. I know what you're up to. That's it. Open it up. You'll pay for screaming at me. All right. He seems to be okay. Nothing seems to be out of order with his details. Like if I look here, everything's matching up. So that's good news. Thought that was saying his weight for a second there. 1700 kg. I was like, oh, you've lost a lot of weight. Congratulations. All right. Inspection finished. You can drive off. Honestly, I just want to see you driving with all the doors open. He rolls up the window. <laughs> I can't forget to roll up the window before I start driving. All right. Next one. All right, what do we got here? Uh, that name doesn't match. There's a spelling mistake. I'm gonna confront him on this. I, I didn't confront him. I just denied him by accident. Um, just wait for vengeance. What What does that mean? <laughs> All right, just enter. I don't care that much if you come in or not. Wait, hold on. Let's talk about this a little bit. <laughs> He's getting upset now. <laughs> just keep opening all of their <laughs> doors and boots and everything. Mark at least one actual error. Oh, I didn't actually mark anything. I just said no <laughs> and handed it back to him. Probably just a typo on his ID. There's gonna be something suspicious in this. What are you hauling, huh? There's something here. Ah, gotcha. Flat tire. All right, I said vehicle damage. Will I just talk to him now and be like, hey, you got a flat tire. You got to go home. No flat tires in our country. But don't hand it out that window. I wanted out the... Fex. Now we put it back in. Give me your feckin' ID or I'm just going to deny you. Wait a second. His passport number doesn't match up either. This is just a disaster, v Vladislav. <laughs> you can't come in here like this. Excuse me, sir. How long it'll take? As long as I want it to take. Um... Vladislav, the poor guy, he's genuinely just coming in, I think. I don't think he's up to any trouble. I'm just giving him a hard time. Especially the fact that I opened that boot. Like, that's probably going to fall off. Next, we just don't allow people into our country, it would seem. I wouldn't have confidence if I rolled up in this car and just ran over the traffic cone. But the fact that... Everyone in front of him got denied. Can't be good. All right, what do we got here? Are this like papers, please. Um, everything looks fine. Wait, I don't think Republic of Kagastam is a real country. You know what? If you live in a fictional country, I'm going to accept you. You deserve to live in a real country. Welcome to wherever it is we are. The Republic of Ireland. <laughs> I never fix their hood or anything. They just drive off. <laughs> I should probably keep an eye on that. All right, I broke even now. <laughs> it was not going well there. I got fined and I was actually in the negative after a hard day's work. Oh, come on, dude. You can't drive in on that. You know what? I'm sure you can find a garage to fix your car here. Oh, look at how enthusiastic he is. I'm sure you'll find a garage, though, to fix that tire. I'm sure you'll be fine. Oh, and everything actually closed on your car. Now, that is modern technology. He shouldn't be allowed in. What? 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 
was it? Was it the tire? I'm being sent to my room. <laughs> oh, so that's where I am. Of course. Akertistan. 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 Yes, of course. <laughs> One of my favorite places, actually. Akertistan, then Ireland. <laughs> okay, two correct checks. That's not bad. That's the third. That's the third that I got right. That's good. About as good as I can expect. Oh, we got suspects now. All right. We're looking for Wallenty. What? No second name? What is he? Like a cartoon character? And we're looking out for someone in a Zave, whatever the hell that is. Just green car. Oh, is that green? No, it's more of a teal. Let him through, boys. Get out the feckin' car. I'm going searching it. You're a suspect. And you're you're bad for trying to transport stuff. Oh, God, I don't think I'm catching it. Wait, wait, wait. We got something. Counterfeit money. What are you doing with this, huh? You know, I'll take it as a bribe and leave you through. Wait, no, it's fake. No. Bad person. Wait, a knife? All right, dude, we take counterfeit money very seriously, apparently. Oh my god, I can actually hurt him! I didn't expect it to work! All right, now that I've subdued him, I'm gonna start opening up your car. If he was smuggling this amount of stuff in the seats and he went to that much trouble, why did he have this just hanging under the glove box? Watch yourself, buddy, all right? Oh, oh my god, I didn't know the right-click hits with the mouse, too. Oh my god, they're filled with... I was gonna say crayons by accident. I meant cigarettes. I don't know why I almost said crayons. What have you got here? Are these frag grenades? Should I be continuing to hit them? Probably not. There we go. I'm letting all the air out of his tires. All right, that's it. You're coming with me. I was going to give him the death penalty, but I guess that's not my decision to make. There you go. Now you get to watch this guy in the bathroom. Oh my God, the blood? <laughs> Sent to labor camp. Labor camp is too far. God damn it. Labor camp is always too far, huh? All right, there we go. That's all the contraband we got from his one car. <laughs> that room was empty beforehand. Oh my God, I'm getting more tools. Pitchfork. <laughs> I'll just have a burning torch and a pitchfork <laughs> ready to kill. Come on, come to Put it in H, come on. Oh, for feck's sake. I just know he is contraband, though. I can smell it. Like, why would you be carrying this truck through here if it had nothing on it? Coming over the border, huh? Good day weather. You don't tell me what kind of weather we're having. I'm gone mad with power. <laughs> All right, one second. Let me open up the seat. I have no reason to do this, but I destroyed vehicle part. No, this is just foam. What are you doing with this counterfeit foam, huh? <laughs> you think you can just bring this into my country? I'm losing a lot of money here. There's gotta be something. You're bringing something into the country. I just gotta find it. Nothing? What? <laughs> tell me where it is. Is. He's like, what are you talking about? Can I have your documents? I mean, you don't really have a choice. I'm holding a pitchfork up to you. Okay, I think you're good to go. Um, well, you're not because, well, I've destroyed your truck completely. I like how he thanked me. You little... <laughs> <laughs> He's like, God, please stop. This is my livelihood. Paper's clean. There we go. I got 100 bucks for that. But I lost like 200 from all the damage I caused. Oh, this is the guy. I don't mean to profile, but you look like a Super Mario villain. <laughs> No, it's not him. This guy's name is Vladimir. I thought it was, uh, Wallenty. You know, I kind of tired myself out on the last person. You you can just go through. Oh, God damn it! He shouldn't have been allowed through! <laughs> I checked everything on the first guy and he was innocent. The second guy, I just gave him a free pass. But no, he was hiding something. That's it. Good cop, bad cop. And I'm bad cop this time. Uh, where's the roof of your car? <laughs> this doesn't look like it's supposed to be a convertible. Wait, I'm getting up on top of his car. What am I looking for here? Just cut the brake lines. There we go. You better not be warranty. No, he's good. He cannot see where he's going at all. What What was his problem? Oh, he had a broken window. Well, he didn't have a feckin' roof. Did it matter? Oh, and his photo didn't match. I didn't even know I should be looking at that. Oh my god, it's warranty. You're coming with me, punk. Hit with pitchfork. Hit with pitchfork. Oh my god, my pitchfork broke. No, crowbar, crowbar. Oh, there we go. What? Game lost. I don't understand. You said he was a suspect. They're like, yeah, for littering. <laughs> We've opened the border. Come on through. <laughs> I just have it permanently up now. This is the guy with the contraband again, isn't it? All right, let me just hold on. There we go. Counterfeit money. You're being arrested. Hey, don't close that on me. Hello, finish control quickly. Well, you know what? I'm gonna go to the bathroom then. I'll be right back. Sorry, guys. Nature calls. <laughs> <laughs> the poor people just staring at me. He's in shock. I'm asserting dominance. All right, sir, I'm back. What takes you so long? Bowel problems. I'm looking for an excuse to not allow this guy into the country. Uh, there's gotta be some reason I can deny you. Dude, come on. <laughs> there is literally nothing wrong with this. There, he is everything above board. Everything is checked and ready. Oh, that's it. You're going to jail. <laughs> Your crime is being rude to me and hurting my feelings. The punishment 
punishment is death. Goodbye. Hey, can you clear up this truck? You can just pull it off to the side if you want. I would like to keep it for my own personal vehicle. I don't know what this button actually even does. I've not been pressing it. Let me give it a try. Oh, it weighs them. Okay, so I can check the weight. Let's see, max weight 1700 kg. Yep. Oh, jeez, you're looking great. Oh, you've lost a lot of weight. Congratulations. Oh, no, your passport number doesn't line up, buddy. Let's put this as an actual reason. Like, give him a reason for not being allowed into the country. Because usually I don't say anything. I just say denied and I don't explain it. Yeah. It looked like he was going to put up an argument there. He went like, yeah, but then I pulled out my switchblade and he backed off pretty quick. I think that was the first one I've actually done right when I told him no. A justified refusal. That is the first time I've gotten that. This one's going to fail on weight, is it? 4,500. Uh, let's see. He's got a smashed window, first of all, anyway, and I didn't do it for once. Why do they always do that like they're playing a Yu-Gi-Oh card? <laughs> it really is just off-putting. Okay, the weight is fine. Passport number looks fine. Okay, so should I reject him for the window or not? I'm going to mark it and then I'm going to say rejected. I don't know if that's justified or not. Why? I just gave you the report. I told you for once. Just careful with that turning circle. Christ almighty. <laughs> going to kill someone over here. Criminal escape. Oh my god, that was warranty, wasn't it? You bastard. <laughs> oh. Oh, he's always one step ahead. <laughs> oh, God damn it, I forgot. Two very different realities. One where I met him and just went, hmm. You can go home. And the other one where I just murdered him with a pitchfork. Not a bad second day on the job. Minus $580. <laughs> we need to free up some space at the post today. Today you're going for a ride. Your taxi to transport prisoners to a labor camp and deliver intercepted contraband to the police base. I'll remember at least half of that. Visit the store along the way to buy some tools. Okay. Oh my God. Should I write this down or something? First, let's deal with our naughty boys. Hey, naughty boys. <laughs> They're like, oh no. What's going to happen? Tell you what's going to happen happen. Murders! Now, no transport necessary. They didn't like that at all. <laughs> all right, let's retry. Transfer to police car. Oh, we're going to have such a good ride together. This is going to be a hell of a road trip. You want to come too? Actually, no. Yeah, I was thinking that too. Anyway, I best get going, moving these prisoners out. Where are they? <laughs> oh, there you are. I'm going to leave this open. I got kind of an honor system going. And we are out in the middle of the woods, so you could probably run, but please don't. Sorry, I've never driven before, so I'm just trying to figure this all out. Uh... Uh, <laughs> I don't really know what I'm doing. Should I get... Yeah, I think I need to go back in there and transfer the stuff. Uh, maybe you should keep an eye on them. I left the door open for no reason. Well, there is a reason, but it's just because of who I am as a person. There we go. Got everything, and I'll put it into the vehicle. There we go. They say I'm ready to go. Even if the door is just hanging open, you could jump out at any time. And the map. Oh, God, this isn't Google Maps. <laughs> I'm here. I need to take a right and then just go straight. A right on the fork. Always stay right. Okay, I'm on it. Wait, no, don't go on the right side of the car. There's no steering wheel over there. Oh, shortcut. Hang on, guys. Oh, feck. Sorry, sorry. Whew. <laughs> Didn't mean to get you whiplash. I apologize. Nearly ran a car off the road as well. They can still see me, by the way. I just left the checkpoint. Oh, for feck's sake. Just ram it. Oh, didn't work. Hold on, guys. <laughs> They're probably dead. I got an axe. Hold on. I'm a man of many talents. Jack of all trades, master of none. <laughs> just screams at me. Please stop. All right, here we are, folks. The labor camp. That's what you get for smuggling crayons into the country. I'd right, send to labor camp, send to labor camp. There you go. Mission complete. Happy days. Well, not, not for them, but for me. Happy days. Look at them. <laughs> They're just getting away at that rock. Just like, <laughs> they're not even trying. All right, I got to get here. So I'll just go forward and take the second left, the dirt trail. Can I go on dirt trails? There, my friend friends again. <laughs> It's literally those two guys. I don't know if it's worth having the labor camp just for those two. We gotta fill that place up. We just gotta start arresting everyone. What? Okay. God damn it. He had the same plan as I did. I wanted to go this way. And clearly the road's fine, even though they say it's under construction. Like, he came this way, so... And look, there's more. I know it's okay. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm taking out my frustration on the vehicle. I should probably turn off the siren. It would be a bit more peaceful. 
No, that doesn't feel right, actually. I think it was the siren making it peaceful. Okay, this dirt track is open. I'll go this way. <laughs> I'm struggling enough to drive on the roads. Never mind the dirt roads. This is a shop? Oh my god. What do they sell? <laughs> Bodies? <laughs> if so, I could get you a supply line. There's a lot of people I could kill. All right, what, what are you... Oh my god, why are you selling scalpels out here? That's scarier than the bodies. Give me this branch. Oh god, he's got a line of customers. Sorry, folks. I didn't realize there was such a demand for scalpels out in this part of the woods. You go ahead. Okay, and last stop is the police base. Ask him all gathered contraband. Oh, yeah, sure. Uh, hold on. I left it in the booth. It's my second day. Third day. I'm kind of new. There we go. I have counterfeit money and an alcohol canister. I don't know if it was worth driving all the way out just to give you these. There you go. And here, I have this branch on the house. Oh, he doesn't want my branch. God damn it. I try and extend an olive branch and he just won't take it. All right, now back home. Better reverse without looking. <laughs> I'm here. Oh my god, I went right through our gate. I, I thought I'd just stop. Congratulations, you did well today. Yes, lots of driving and all on a single tank of kerosene. This is quite the vehicle. Anyway, I best catch some Z's. And look at the state of the place. It was fine before I showed up. Ah yes, Sunday. April 19th. Food over production. As is tradition in Motherland, we have too much food. This is not propaganda. This is truth. This is my truth. The following products are not allowed. Food. <laughs> oh yeah, we just there's so much of it. He's like, this is literally my lunch. It's an apple and some crackers. Can I just... No, too much food in our country already. We are bursting at seam. Jesus, look at that flat tire. Fucking hell, I hope you're not hauling anything heavy. Oh, Christ almighty. Unpack an apple crate. Wait, you're bringing apples? Yeah, I know what they say. An apple a day keeps the doctor away, but it also sends you to prison. I'm arresting you. Okay, surely he can't. Oh, he does have a lot of cargo. I was just about to say that I won't have to deal with the cargo, but I do. Ah, sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to go that close to you. I'm gonna open these bags one way or another. Why are you doing this? Some sick twisted thrill? I don't know, my upbringing maybe? That's right. I was a Minecraft YouTuber. Show me the contraband. I know you have something. That's it. All right. Tire popped. You're not allowed in. You can't mark parts that you've already damaged. God damn it. All right. Just go on in then. It's fine. Sorry about the anger. That's just, again, who I am as a person. It just comes out in flashes of anger. Go, go on ahead. Enjoy the sightseeing. Uh, look in your right just up ahead. You'll see the last two people I dealt with. They're in the, the labor camp. Oh, goddamn hippies. You're not allowed in my country. Oh, wait. Hold on. How? What the hell is this? Flammable substances. You want to be more uh, clear on that? What's in here? Tell me. <laughs> he must be freaking out. This is highly dangerous. Even if there was a spark off the mess. All right, everything checks out. Just be careful on the road. There's so many potholes up ahead that <laughs> that driver should be returned. They're like, I know we specifically told you not to allow food in, but he's literally going in with explosive material. You just let him in? Oh, for feck's sake, what is this? You're not allowed to bring your dogs into my country. <laughs> Careful with the goats. They could just jump out at any point. Yes, that was fine. Okay, my last one of the day. Let's go. He's already rolling up with a flat tire. This doesn't look good. Puffy. Uh, surely that's not allowed. I may be willing to accept the bribe, though. You know, maybe give me some of that coffee. All right, you got one flat tire, and I'm going to say the, the food is the issue. So denied. And on the bright side, even if you got to drive all night to get back there, you got your coffee. All right, have a good time. Invalid inspection report. Damn it. I'm just gonna try and make my escape. This work clearly isn't for me. Oh, I keep coming back. This is horror. Here we go. This is my only way out of this job by becoming an axe murderer. There we go. I'm fired. <laughs> All right, we are going to end it there. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know if you want to see more games like this. Leave a like, drop a comment. I appreciate it. Thank you so much for watching. Appreciate you, and I hope to see you tomorrow. Bye for now.